Just trying to get in people's faces today. Your first amendment auditors, welcome. <laughs> you made an assumption of what my assumption it's is. Assumption Ooh, where we are now. Wow, you're hey, a child. Look at that. He's a child. Right. Don't answer him. You also can't tell us to stop filming. It's a 50 50 shot. Um, you guys have a really creepy vibe. That's crazy. Did they request it? What is this all about? I'm ask you guys to relocate somewhere else. No, I think it's I'm filming stupid everybody. what you're doing. Curious why we don't have anything else to do. I'm not harassing women. I have an attorney. For 28 years, I did not know what I did not know. Uh, you're just filming women try dresses on? Just walking around putting cameras and faces. I'm just coming out here making sure you guys ain't causing havoc. I do have to understand. Why do you have to understand? I got a phone call that you guys are recording. I want to disseminate sinfulness. Yeah. Do you ever want to meet some friends? What the hell are you doing? Yeah. You're messing with my dispatch. You can't be here. This is a store. We got business will be going on. So can you define harassment if you're going to accuse us of it? I like yours too. I know. My wife told me how to wear my best face when I leave the house. <laughs> Welcome to Impact Media, where we explore the captivating world of public filming, exposing a society immersed in cameras and ignorance. Join us for a thrilling ride as we enlighten, entertain, and make you facepalm at the astonishing lack of privacy awareness. We relentlessly remind people they are under constant surveillance, and any desired privacy must be self-created. Experience the natural reactions of unsuspecting individuals to public filming. Laugh, question, and brace yourself for eye-opening and mind-boggling moments that make you wonder, did that really just happen? Gain knowledge about your rights and freedoms in a tech-driven world where even your coffee cup could be spying on you. Welcome to a channel that exposes absurdities, one camera at a time. At Impact Media, we disseminate all our interactions for public consumption of our educational media. Every captured interaction, whether humorous, thought-provoking, or educational, is made available to the public. We believe in spreading awareness and knowledge, ensuring our content reaches as many people as possible, and you can help by liking this video now. Through sharing our encounters, we engage and educate a wide audience, empowering individuals to navigate the complexities of a tech-filled society while keeping our rights in mind. Remember, your support is crucial in amplifying our message. Don't forget to take a second and like our videos so the YouTube algorithm bots can share them far and wide. Together, let's make a powerful impact. All right, guys, we are back here in beautiful Orange County, and today we will be with my two sons and uh, Long Beach Observer, I think, is gonna come along here shortly and join us. Uh, this is a huge uh, street for us to handle. Um, so we are gonna try to split up a little bit. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go ahead and uh, do some public street audits today, remind people that they're constantly being filmed while they're out in public, as well as remind them that you have the right to film in public, thank you to our forefathers, and that if you want and demand and expect privacy while you are out in public, you have the responsibility to create the level of privacy that you want while you are out in public. Look at this beautiful Lexus, guys. I love these. Just record life as it happens and right now you guys happen in front of us so who are you with we don't disclose that while we're out here working well you don't disclose that yeah okay, yeah, we don't that right okay. well do you know jesus since i'm on camera do you know jesus do you have a relationship with jesus i personally do not i'm not interested in one oh. well he is the gift of life for eternal life. I'm not anti-religious, I just am agnostic. I understand, so. I understand. But we'd love to invite you to Saddleback Newport Mesa. If you're ever in town. Do you want to meet some church? Do you ever want to meet some friends? We're at 1901 Newport Mesa. I'll share that with everybody. And, and I'm an attorney. You're an attorney? I have an attorney. Sweet. I'm what kind of law do you practice? All. All of it? I do it all. Human nice, rights nice. and immigration is my specialty. Okay, well that's kind of cool. But I do it all. I mean, I meet all, all, all types of people. Like I'm meeting you guys doing this. Nice, nice. Legal stuff. No, this is legal. No, this is illegal. It is, no, it's legal. If you're an attorney, you should know this. No, it's, not to, not freedom of speech is, but not to just walk up and, and record something. You are absolutely allowed to record in public. Okay, well, let and, me record you guys. 
Yeah, yeah absolutely. Recording me. I'll even post. Oh my goodness. You guys just made my day. <laughs> I don't want to yell the conversation. Oh, okay. Sorry. You get if you, you turn it, if in. you turn it sideways, okay, perfect. <laughs> Sorry. You guys come in. No, no, that's fine. So no, come on, I don't have you in. Get in. <laughs> so you guys just spend so out we, here. So we we practice our First Amendment rights, but you as a lawyer, you should know that. Okay. Um, so we're allowed to do this anywhere in public. It's not like we're going into private property recording anybody. Um, so we are recording from public. Anything okay. that we can see, you okay. can't trespass the eyes. So if we can see it from public, we're allowed to record it. Okay, so that's your job. You just come out. Uh, that's that's well, one you know of what many I things. Well, you know what so we, we actually remind people. So uh -huh. we're an educational platform. So we actually remind people that when you're out in public, uh -huh. you are being filmed over a hundred times a day when you leave your house. Uh -huh. And if you want, demand, or expect privacy while you're out in public, the onus is on each individual person to create that level of privacy themselves. Right. And so why did you choose Corona Del Mar? What's that? Why did you Why did you guys choose Corona Del Mar? So we go all over the country. Oh, you do? Yeah. Why do you cover your face? Yeah, why do you cover your That's face? That's part of, I just explained that through teaching that it, the onus of your privacy is on you to create it yourself. I see. Well, like I said, uh, we're out here. Um, spreading God's love, and you guys are always welcome to Saddleback Church, Newport Mesa. And if you want to come with your mask on, <laughs> <laughs> if you want to come with your mask on, that is just great. Yeah, as you mentioned, I have extensive training in legal, yeah. but I love studying God's law, which is the highest law, and the gift of God is eternal life. So yeah, I we do. Get, we're getting ready to plant these. Uh, plant these signs, so I'm going no, no, to stop this right now. You're fine, you're fine. All right, but uh, nice meeting you guys. No, no, it's been I wonderful. I hope you show up. I do have one question, though. Okay. And this is more like the attorney question. Uh -huh. Why do you believe that what we are doing is illegal? Uh, I don't want to get into all of that. All right. I just want to... You know, you have to okay. do legal research. I'm not trying no, no, to... No, no, and I've done... Yeah, so I'm not I, trying we actually, to... We actually decay. have First Amendment lawyers that defend everything that we do. Well, here, here's the thing. You know, you do what you do. You know yeah. what I mean? I'm not trying to fight you or yeah. anything, get into legal battle with that. Yeah. I'm just, uh, I've never had nobody come up behind me with cameras and stuff. So you actually, it was funny because we were walking down the sidewalk. You guys actually intersected right in front of us as we were walking. I know, I thought that so, was just, and I kept, yeah. I like I got so it wasn't cameras. that we were specifically behind you guys. You guys happened to intersect in front of us. Oh, we didn't see you. Without looking left. Okay. <laughs> oh my goodness. Well, we're getting ready to you guys, here. you guys have a blessed day. Yeah. All right. Listen, hold the sign for me. Hold, hold it. Yeah, hold All the right, sign. I'll, I'll hold it. I'll hold it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, God, this is crazy, man. This is crazy. <laughs> this is oh great for marketing. Goodness. This will create all kinds of conversation. Hold on just a second. Hold on. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay. You know what? I'm trying to learn. How do I put this on camera? I got it on my phone. So, is this an iPhone? Or, yeah. Oh, you're on uh, uh, Right here? Um, so you're on photo. You want a photo? Yeah. Right there. <laughs> they don't get no better than So, this. let me show you one thing on your iPhone real quick, just so for future reference. So, lock it. Go ahead and close the phone. Okay. Just close it. Like, push the lock button right here. Okay. So you always have access to the camera right here just by long pressing oh, that okay. opens it automatically it okay. without having to unlock your phone. My daughter bought this for me. No, no, you're fine. I guess I tell my age. Yeah, no, you're Thank fine, you. you're fine. But that way if you ever have to urgently pull out your phone, you're not okay. fumbling with it. It's just on the lock screen on the lower right and you just long press it and it opens. Okay. All right, you All have right. a blessed day. You too. Yep. Oh, Easter <laughs> Sunday. <laughs> You, you got, got an Easter egg, huh? <laughs> really, it comes just like you are. Just to just that would be that would be kind of funny. It would be fun. I appreciate. We're at 19. I'm one of the leaders there. Worship oh, are you? Leaders. Nice, My nice. husband, Bob. Hi, Bob. And boy, this would be great. We would love having you guys. <laughs> hey, we, we love, love you guys. Love. You guys have been great. Love you too. You guys have a wonderful day. Bye. You yep. Too.
All right, guys, we hadn't even started the day. We already ran into our first people. That was great. Um, she's a lawyer that didn't know that this was legal. Uh, that's a little concerning, but I do appreciate her kindness. So just so you guys understand how far away, this is how far we are away right now. Uh, we are on the sidewalk here. Nick needs to move forward a little bit so he's not blocking the sidewalk. But um, I do make sure to kind of keep on top of them to make sure they're not, you know, obstructing anybody. Um, but we are quite the distance. If I'm going to guess how far away we are from this couple right here, um, I'm going to guess it's about 65 to 70 feet with a marginal error of maybe three or four feet. Margin of error, margin of error uh, with several feet, so. Long Beach in the house. Long Beach in the house. Look at that hair though, I like her hair. I'm assuming it's about us. The area that you are in right now you almost have to get a credit check to be able to sit at these restaurants. Only on the phone about us. She keeps looking. I was about to say that. She just walked in, saw that we were recording her, walked inside, and turned around again. Loving on that tea. Long Beach. Long Beach. Pausing the disturbance out here. We've been filming elsewhere. Hold on. I can't hear you. What happened? I'm sorry. I'm not comfortable. Wait, what happened? I can't hear you. It's traffic. Okay, please stop filming me. I'm not giving my consent to be filmed. You're in public, sir. Yeah, you don't you don't have to give your consent. Got it. That was strange. If you're gonna come out and talk to us, come out and talk. If not, go away. And we're getting a camp bag. Damn, called back in the nick of time. He thought about it. Oh, he thought about <laughs> it. <laughs> buddy talked him out of it. Smart move, smart move. You're not intelligent enough for this conversation. <laughs> he is loving that tea. He is almost out. Hopefully the server notices. I do love his sunglasses though. So they did call security, it looks like. Hey gentlemen, good afternoon. What's that? It said 
hey gentlemen good afternoon i can barely hear you because all the traffic but what's up um i got a phone call that you guys are recording i don't know what you guys are recording okay. but there is no recording in front of the actual restaurant said who um the owner from the restaurant what law is that yeah i'm gonna be honest with you i don't know but right. if, if the owner from the restaurant is requesting for me to come and talk to you guys, I got to do my end of the deal. Okay. Um, I don't know what you guys are filming. I'm pretty sure it's something. We're not going to disclose that. Um, no, I'm saying I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm going to assume it's something good for you guys to be filming and to be masked up because okay. you guys don't want to reveal your identity. Okay. But I got to do my part of the deal and ask you guys to relocate somewhere else. So we're not going to move. Okay. Yeah, he, um, I'll tell you that right now. He doesn't have any control over public property. And he property. also has no jurisdiction on public property. Okay, but the problem is that you guys are next to his restaurant. Doesn't matter. So, do you think, by law, can I tell you, if you're walking on the sidewalk, can, am I allowed to tell you not to look in that direction? No. Okay. The way the law works, you can't trespass the eyes, so you can't trespass the lens. So you cannot tell somebody on a public sidewalk. That'd be like you're walking here with your phone and him saying that you can't point it towards the restaurant. It's false. Completely false. Does that, does that logic seem skewed to you that you, that they think that no, we no, can no, do no. that? I completely understand okay. your perspective. It's I not perspective. It's law. But I, whatever it is, okay. I, I completely understand what you're trying to tell me. Yep. I'm just saying he does not feel comfortable having you guys. I can't control his comfort and I'm not going to stop doing what I'm doing. I'm going to stay right here. Can I suggest something? You can yes, tell him that we have every right to be here and record, take pictures because we're on a public sidewalk. You, you can go ahead and tell him that, see how he feels, but that's, that's our right. I mean, you're more than entitled to go ahead and walk in the restaurant and address that yourself as well. No, not at all. We're, we th then we'd be going on to private property. Yeah, you're the, you're just especially the medium, if he yeah. says he's uncomfortable with us, we don't want to risk it. But if he's trying to call you and have you kick us off of public property, which oh, you no, can't no, do. No, 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 okay. I'm, just, I, it's, it's, I'm not coming to kick you guys off property. But you did tell are, us to stop filming. Yeah, the whole filming part. But that's part, unlawful. The, the whole filming part. Uh-huh. And that's a whole different story. But I'm not kicking you guys off hey, property. The filming, you but you, but you property. can't, but you also can't tell us to stop filming. It's a 50 50 shot. No, it's not. It's really not. I'm telling you by law. Because he doesn't want his restaurant it, to come out in the video. It doesn't matter. So if we were over it there, does not he matter. Could tell us to stop. We would be on We are property. in public. He cannot tell me in what direction I am allowed to point my camera when I'm on public property. Okay. Does that make sense to you? Yes. Yeah, hey, sense. the law supports me doing this. This is my job. I do this full time. You are not allowed. You're not able. I mean, you could try, but you're not able to lawfully make a directive that tells me I can't point my camera at his restaurant. Okay. If you call law enforcement, they're going to tell you the exact same thing. No, I'm not going to call law enforcement because there's no point of it. You guys are not inside the property. Proper, exactly. I'm, I'm just addressing something. Yeah. That was addressed but to I me. can, and I'm going to continue pointing my camera at their direction. Okay. I'm going to take video of all their patrons, and I'm going to take video of all the workers, and nobody is going to be able to stop me doing that. Okay. I mean, if somebody comes out to you guys and says anything, that's above and beyond my They can say all they want. No, no, they can say all they want, but they can't do anything about it. Okay. Well, to my understanding, if I don't want you guys filming me, you guys can't film. You're me. in public. So if, so if I was yeah, on. But did I give you guys approval? To you film? don't have to. You're in public. Yeah, There's yeah. zero That's expectation okay. under law. There is no expectation of privacy when you are out in public. Well, to my understanding. You're misunderstanding. I do this for a living. I know the law. I have attorneys that back us up and doing everything that we do. I travel the country doing this. I know what I'm doing. Okay. I, I do this full well, time. Again, I'm just addressing. So you are, I was addressing I'm just me. saying you are misunderstanding. You're going to have to Google right to privacy out in public it doesn't exist okay well, I'm, I'm, I'm just like i said i'm just doing my end of the deal sorry, i'm right. just addressing something no no I'm not, so i'm not, I'm not saying so no no you, like you have not been an asshole to us at all so i'm not suggesting you are i just i need you to understand that if you're going to be sent on behalf of somebody to attempt to deter people from doing something that you need to know what laws back you up and what laws don't. And right now there's not a law in the books that backs you up from doing what you're doing right now. Hey guys, so she wasn't an asshole, but I will say this, that's another untrained allied security guard. We already know with allied, 99% of them have no idea what laws back up their jobs and how far they are allowed to go with, uh, you know, directives and things like that. No idea. I am on public property. I am performing a lawfully protected activity on public property. 
I'm going to continue performing that activity on public property and there is nothing that they can do to stop it. Yeah, they got two. He's here to assess the damage. What are we working with? Oh, she's just cam backing up. As you guys can see, a wild Karen in the forest. Comfort security. <laughs> Comfort security. Turn on. <laughs> Am I ruining the shot? Oh, no, you made the it. shot. <laughs> we're waiting for you. Huh? Uh, we're waiting for you. <laughs> someone's eating in there. Someone's have the same haircut. Yeah, there it is. All those ladies have like the same hair barber. <laughs> He's educating them. Newport Beach. Dude, they can do a tag team wrestling match. Uh, two, two cops, two security guards. Let's go. And then the security, he's got like his mom as a ride along, or the, the cop. The cop has a little old lady in the front seat. So they just said we didn't have permission to film them, so. I brought a few more cameras. Oh, that's not nice. That's so lady, you can sit on that. Or maybe your husband will sit on it. That was very rude, man. Hey guys, so the cops just left. Security is still hanging out with four security guards. We came back over here and I was immediately told I can't film. So what am I doing? Filming. No, you're fine. I'm shooting over your head. Getting shots of the restaurant here. So you can't barely see in here anyways, but... Um, you can actually see more of me. How you doing, brother? Hey guys, how are you? So it was uh, these, these two right here. There's this one and then her. That's one of the workers. Hi. How you doing? May I ask you guys why are you guys? Uh, What's that? I don't want to be at the camera, but I. What's wanna... that? Well, you walked out into the camera. But uh, why are you guys? Uh... Taking some video. Oh, we're just we're, we're here taking video of a couple of the patrons right here. Did they request it? I don't know if they did or not, but 
Um, I'm just here, people watching. Well, they were asking me, and they're like a little frustrated, like uh, yeah. you're old masking. And there's, I'm there's, no, I can't help them with their feelings or how they're feeling, but we're just um, taking some videos of people in there. That's all. I was trying to record the manager over there calling the cops and then... <laughs> oh damn, they're all out there. Sheesh! They got the whole squad following The boys came out. Yeah, that's what I was saying. They're in there, they're in there. There's I can't even see shit in this window. That's what yeah. people don't understand. Like, <laughs> the biggest part about this all is we can't see shit through this window except for the people that are sitting right up against it. Um, so that's the funny part about all this. They're all freaking out, but we can't see any of them. Also, by the way, guys, I have this beautiful shirt on day, uh, free speech. So more important than your feelings all the time. Filming us right there, the whole sidewalk. They didn't ask me. Bro. Bro. The lady right here is on the front of the fence. This lady right here is on the front of the fence. Well, that yeah. Damn, that looks amazing. Do a story on us? <laughs> Maybe. Where's your story at, guys? What's the story? Uh, what the, <laughs> the entire fuck is They got the film like film crew calling up. Jeez. See, how are they complaining about us being here when they have a film crew pulling up? <laughs> what the hell? What is going on? Their cameras are 20 times the size. Yeah, they did not have to show off like that. <laughs> How are you going to complain about us to have that pull in? Oh, they're pulling up on us. They're like, oh, you guys got He's got the biggest one of the group right here. Look at this thing. This thing, you got to tame this beast. <laughs> This guy pulled in hot and then parked in. Now he's. Oh shit. Now he's parking in red. She's parked in a red. You know you're parked in red, right? Yeah. Are you feeling privileged? Oh. Yeah, that was rude, but look at them wheels. She curved the. Oh, yeah, that kid. She is kissing curves on the regular. Jesus. Damn. 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 Damn.
going on in a red zone. <laughs> What's this, lady? Come on. Appropriate. Come Wait, on. what? What you guys doing? This is not right. Very appropriate. You're being aggressive. Wait, what do you mean? What's You're being aggressive. Hold on. Do you want to? Ex nice. But do you want to explain, or are you just no, going to no, come? No. In? What is Sir, this you're being aggressive. Oh, no, what is this all about? Okay, we're well, being aggressive. But are no, you no, going to know what it's all about? Hey, take it down a notch. Okay, okay, well, are you going to Are you going to explain why no, what we're no, doing is inappropriate? No, you're taking pictures while eating. What, what is it all about? What is this? Is that illegal? No, no, I'm asking. What is it all about? Taking pictures while eating. Wait, okay, can you not read? There's a camera crew no, it doesn't in matter. there. But what, so the First Amendment, so free speech doesn't matter in the United States? Do you realize where you're standing? I don't know what's all about. Okay, but do you realize? You're taking pictures while eating. Okay. You got this lady angry. You're standing a in the of U.S. of A. Car. It's a beautiful a country. Of this, lady's car. Hey, this is not right. You, just in a red you are, yeah. you are standing you know. in a beautiful you country, you disrespecting the First yourself. Amendment. Relax. You are you disrespecting the First Amendment. You need to calm down. You need, like he did. See, he knows how to handle it. That's a mature adult. You need to get a life, man. He was literally foaming from the mouth. Jesus. Hey, we've been waiting for you. Hello. Where you been at? Finally, you're here. Oh, uh, now he's in there yelling at other people. I feel bad. Oh. Uh, uh, that's not how you communicate, sir. <laughs> that was unnecessary. Unnecessary, that's a great word. Unnecessary. Dude, people are <laughs> Perfect time to film a commercial, right? With everyone screaming and yelling and upset and pissed. Yeah, dude, everyone looks pissed. That guy is so mad at us right here. I can barely see him. This guy is so pissed at us. I could barely see that fool. I could barely see him. And he is letting us destroy his lunch for no reason. He doesn't have to behave that way. He absolutely does not need to behave that way. He is acting a fool. His entire family, all of his friends are telling him to shut the heck up. No sense, no sense. Guys, when you got that much anger that you have to decompress yourself in a public restaurant like that, that's all bad. He needs anger classes. I've never seen somebody this irate. The most mature, emotionally mature people here are the been the ones eating outside here. You guys have been nice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I appreciate you guys all being right. super kind. You have a blessed day. Hey, go good luck with the little one, man. Right. You guys be safe. Which was the only people that we could actually see were the most emotionally mature people. They had a baby, they didn't, you know, have any other worries other than taking care of their child, enjoying a moment of peace probably outside of raising a brand new baby. Um, that is an emotionally connected person with themselves. Great parents, good job, amazing. While everybody inside that we can barely see, by the way, because I can see more of myself here, these, these guys are losing their damn minds. The ones that are sitting out here were fine with us. You know what? Worry about your eternal life. Instead of standing here, life is short. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Life. You're gonna throw religion in this situation, and no, if you're I doing religion sure. that way, you're doing it wrong, and you're going to hell. I know. Geez, I'm, I know. I'm gonna go to heaven. If I die today, I know I'm going to go to heaven. No, because you're not. I am not acting like Jesus that, you're not. The way. If Je Jesus, Jesus is not okay with you behaving, behaving that way. The no, way no, you're Jesus, behaving. But Jesus, do you believe in Jesus? Jesus. No. You can't intentionally behave like a no, no, dick like and then expect forgiveness. That's not how it works. No, no, no. I'm, I'm not behaving like that. I'm telling you, I'm, I'm, how do you know I'm going to heaven or hell? How do you know? Because you're a bad person. No, no, the way no, you no, came out person. and screamed at us. That's bad? That's lawful. I'm allowed to do that under free, you know, First Amendment. Yeah, how do you feel that you're eating someone taking picture of you? I don't mind it. I don't mind it. You wave hello. Give them a high five. No, not, not a big deal. Now you're going up everywhere being an asshole. I'm going to the way. I'm going And now you're going to be famous for being a dick. Okay. If you repent, you're going to go to hell. Hey, that's your fairy tale, not no, mine. That's a fact. That's no, a fact. really? Prove it. Right now, no, prove Jesus it. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the light. Prove it. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the light. You prove it. You're full of shit. Prove no, it. Prove, prove it right now. You're swearing. I'm going to go to heaven. You're swearing. Prove it. You're swearing. You're swearing. You're swearing. I don't want to go to a fake place. It's imaginary land. It's like Santa Claus. Do you also believe in Santa? Are you going to go to heaven? Do you also believe in Santa Claus? Are you going to go to heaven? It doesn't matter. Listen but to your you wife to and go how, do you, how do you know heaven exists? Well, what if you, what if you just die? Said, the Bible talks about heaven. What if you just die? 
If I die, I'm gonna go to heaven. Okay, what if you don't? What if you just die and that's it? But I'm gonna go to heaven. If I die, I don't know. That's, go to heaven. What if that's not a thing? What if you've been fed lies? What if you've been fed lies? What if you've been fed lies? What I what? What happens if you've been fed lies and there is no heaven? Well, the Bible is the word of God. It's not the lie. The Bible. No, it's not. It's yes, written Bible by human. The Bible is the word of man. The Bible is the word of God. You don't the Bible was written by men. What do you mean it was written by man? How do you not know that? How do I know this? The Bible is written by men through the voice of God. Inspired. The Bible is inspired. Okay, and you know what? But you know what else is inspired? Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. That's a wonderful story inspired by fairy tale. The Bible is inspired by the Holy Spirit, right? The Holy Spirit. You got it wrong, buddy. No, I don't got it wrong. The Bible is the word of You got it wrong. If you don't repent, if you don't give your life to Jesus, you're going to go to hell. So are you for saying that. I already gave my life to Jesus. I am already saved. No, you're not. You can't be saved and then act like a dick. I'm not acting like this. You did. You did. You did. You're aggressive. Apologize. Forgiveness. 25 Hail Marys and you're saved. Jesus. When people try to throw religious at me, man. How do you anger religion to people? The manager came out with money. So we just... Your Tesla trucks. I just got told no. Uh-oh. Wait, what? You have more financial information and customers come in. Oh. So you can't convince the company. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, hold on. I can, I can film anything I want through the windows. It's your, you have to maintain privacy, not me. Wait, you just got confidential information out like that? You should probably put it away. So you're the, the, the customer, doesn't matter. The customer's privacy is on you guys to take care of, not us. This guy's giving us an internal cam bag. Okay. Right he's mute. Are you making? Are you making a video? He's oh. practice. So he's trying to practice his First Amendment right, there but he's doing it on private property. Alright. Oh, you're building. Alright. That's cool. I know. Do you like being a landlord? I love it. Perfect. This is a lot of nice people. That's good. Yeah. How's your day going? Wonderful, actually. I have a question for you, though. I love your mask. All right, thank you very much. Halloween's over. And this isn't a Halloween mask. It looks like it. All right. Well, if you're going to throw insults uh, instead of have a conversation, What's then... insulting about Halloween? I love Halloween. All right. Sir, have you ever heard of I was trying to have a conversation with you. Okay. Alright. Sir, have you ever heard of privacy? Nah, I don't. I don't, I don't know that. Have a nice day. You have a blessed day, buddy. Be safe. Enjoy the sunshine. You got a few years left. Enjoy it. Our beautiful American flag flying up there in a clock. So we can't disclose what we're doing uh -huh. while we're working. Uh -huh. So I can neither confirm nor deny that. Uh -huh. Do you have another question? No, there. My brother <laughs> watches like people, I guess I do stuff like that. And after I seen it, after I was like, oh, I just want to send a picture of him to you guys. <laughs> you want a yeah. picture with us? Well, do you want a selfie? Yeah, let's do that. All right, let's do, do a selfie, but do it wide so you can get all of us in there. I don't know if we're gonna work that way. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> Thank you. But yes, to answer your question. You guys have a good day. Be safe out here. Uh, yes, though. Okay. You have a good day. Have a good day. <laughs> Hi. She gave us a wave. Hi. Everyone wave. Oh, 
Guys, I'm gonna put something in perspective for you right here, real quick. She's gonna cam back us real quick, but look, they're literally in a fishbowl. And as a child, I was told that when people or things or anybody's put in a cage, uh, like lions and 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 fish, that you film them and you watch them, and that's what we're doing out here today. Hello. What happened? Can I, help you I don't need any help though. No, we're all good. Like, What's that? What happened? No. All right. I think I just went out again. They got excited because they thought we were leaving. Tacos. What's that? What do you need? What are you recording for? What happened? What are we recording for? I can't tell you that while we're working. What's the okay, deal with well, this? What happened? What's the deal? What do you mean? Like we're asking you what's going on. You're recording. Why is he recording me? You feel the same thing? Yeah, because it's my personal right to be here and not to okay. be, uh, to be recorded. Okay. So hold on, hold on. You have a right not to be recorded? I didn't private realize private that was a thing. It is. That's not in the Constitution. What happened? Okay. So that's not in your Bill of Rights, sir. If you see my shirt, this should explain to you. Maybe you got to look it up. Maybe you have been around too long. You haven't refreshed your Bill of Rights <laughs> education. You're so young. You can say that, right? I, I am. I am. No. Okay. Right here. Here. All right. No, no, I'm not. All right. Not but do you not know our Bill of Rights? Whatever. Okay. You can say that, but it's okay. really important that you know our Bill of Rights. I said it's in the right not to be recorded. Let's have them get the two bucks. Come on. They don't want to be in the fishbowl anymore. We can go further in too. Oh yeah. This is a beautifully handsome man right here. If I had a jawline like that, I'd be getting laid every weekend. Here's it. He got to get all the chicks. Hold on, who have we harassed? Who did we harass? I, What's that? That's not harassing. You just got here? You don't know the whole story. I saw you here. Like okay, but you were but are we? Is it against? We talking about being, your bill of rights. Yes, yeah. but is that against the law to film while we're out in public? Well, it's kind of harassing when you. It's not harassing. That's a very that's a legal term. So can you define harassment if you're going to accuse us of it? Well, yeah, I wouldn't. If I'm sitting there, I wouldn't want somebody to stand. Okay, but that's not harassment. Harassment you think is it's polite. It, 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 well, polite is perspective. That might be, you, you might know, see you it. You think it's very I, I think, so polite. I think educating people about our Bill of Rights is absolutely polite, no matter the forum. So why do you have to educate them about Bill of Rights? Why not? But why do you need to? Because they obviously don't Because they're not aware. So educated. if they're not aware, don't they deserve to know and be made aware of our Bill of Rights? And it's their rights so too. So you mean your Bill of Rights is to stand here and take pictures of them and you think that that's No, no, right but it's, our, it's a way for us to educate people you on our Bill of Rights. You are making them feel It's your rights too. You make them feel uncomfortable. I can't. I can't solve that problem. So, like, but uh, so. Don't you think that there's a more pleasant way to try? People to don't listen when you do it pleasant, things? do they? They only feel uncomfortable because they don't understand. So pleasant is the school system that has failed well, everybody see, and doesn't teach people their see, rights. To me, the whole problem is the way you dressed automatically. Miss, what's wrong with privacy? Privacy. Ma'am, you got to create. Yeah, the, why can't they have privacy? But you have to create there? your own level of privacy. Why can't they have privacy? Let me answer. There? Let me answer. Okay. They, they can create their own privacy. For example, they can put a mask on. They can move tables. Which well, they why did. Why would they have to move tables from there when they see? If you don't want to be seen, why would you sit in a giant fishbowl on guys a public are, sidewalk? You guys are crazy. You All right. Absolutely crazy. Where are you going? All right. Just keep talking. I got to go back and look at this beautiful man over here. Look at that. He's going to turn me gay. <laughs> Everybody in the fishbowl is staring at us now.
Who, me? Uh-oh. It's coming out all aggressive, like. It's like they're creating their own product, too. It's glass. Well, yeah, I can not, still see through. Not, as, not so smart, but they didn't <laughs> cause a scene. They just closed the door. Even though I technically can't see through very well, but it's funny that they closed the glass door. That's an educated guy right there. Well, can't hate it. Art. Yeah. How are you doing today? I'm doing good. I just recognized the mask. <laughs> Here, take, uh, let me, hold on. Let me take a picture with you. Woo! All right. You guys have a wonderful day. Said, please film us. Oh, yeah, you guys look good. You guys look great. Looking good, everybody. You know, it's nice. funny that the weirdo in the back has to be weird about this because I actually love your hair. Oh, shit. I got you. You know, I believe in free speech, but what not about harassing press? people. What about you know what? Press? Hold on. So, so when he flipped us off, that's not harassing us because that's actually what he did. That's you may not have seen that, that's but he did flip us off. Yeah, so wait. that goes both ways. It's a two-way street. So I was being nothing but respectful to you guys. You got, I even said he had beautiful hair, but then he went and flipped us off. So that's actually harassing yeah. us. Yeah, but recording it's people without their permission. That's not harassment. Rude. That's You're not harassment. It's called free rude. speech. Free speech. It's in the Bill of Rights. Yeah, it is free speech. But it's rude. Perfect. Now you know. I love her response, that was amazing. <laughs> doing here this is crazy you are not putting a sharp stick next to my eye while people stare at me through a glass window what happened what happened we're, we're not going in yeah but you don't have to take pictures you guys can actually ask what do you mean why can't we take pictures we're on a public sidewalk ma'am practicing our First Amendment right. Oh, okay. Thank you. But so and why you are filming? So we're reminding people as part of this that you're being filmed in public everywhere you go at all times. I mean, the street lights, the cars are filming you now. Tesla's got cameras all over them. Oh. Filming, recording you 24-7. Every building you walk by in front of or into is filming you 24-7. And if you want, demand, or expect privacy while you're out in public, the onus is on each individual person to create that level of privacy that they want. That's what we so share. It's performative art. You can call it that. Very but with your beautiful thing. smile, you, you know, you, you can't not want to be filmed. Thank you guys are beautiful. Oh my God. Thank you. You guys, you guys are good. look good too, but your mask. Hey, I put my best face on because my wife told me I have to do this to, so that people aren't scared. Oh, okay. You want to scare people. Too. This is my scare, this is my non-scary face. Okay, don't use our picture for any other purpose. <laughs> 
Where are you going? I've eaten lunch. Aww. Lunch break. Is there lunch? Capturing beautiful faces. That's good. I love the color. Thanks. What's that? I have to do it here. I don't, I don't want to, what are, you, are you filming? You don't have the right to film. You have an app. So I can't be, I, I can't be filming. Don't, don't film people who don't want but to. But I'm not filming because that would require a different kind of technology you, here. You but, have a camera and you're filming. Okay, no, this is recording. Stop. I'm recording. Stop. Filming is a little different. So stop dancing. Stop what you're doing. I'm recording, ma'am. It's bullshit. Nick, go. Yeah, recording is the same as filming, so stop your bullshit and move on. I'm, I'm not stopping anything. I'm going to stay right here. Okay, but you don't disclose that. You get us your... We don't have to disclose that, sir. Okay. All right. What are you recording? What happened? What are you recording? Well, now you. But for what reason? I can't share that while we're working. I just I don't understand what's... What happened? I don't understand what's going on. But I mean, do you have to understand? I do have to understand. Why do you have to understand? You just want to know. Is this political? What is this? It's not political at all. Well, then what is it? I just. I'm, I'm just not going to share that with you right now. Okay. okay. You, know, not, you walked out kind of aggressive. You got in his face. I didn't. Gr I just said, hey, can I talk to you for a minute? That's okay. what I said. But you, you got really close here. to him. Did I get that close? To yeah, you got very close. Oh, you guys are those. All right. We're those? So suddenly you're gonna put us in a box? What are those? I bet your I bet your ancestors wouldn't feel great about putting people in a box. No, no. If I was coming to talk to you guys, okay. to, if I could help you out in any way, that's. What I, I don't need your help, but I appreciate the offer. Okay. I'm assuming you do plumbing, but I don't have any plumbing issues right now. Yeah. Well, I assume you guys are doing filming. Unless but leaky butt counts as a plumbing issue. Hard, but it's not ours. <laughs> I like that. It's cool. That's actually from the barber down the street. They're really friendly. Yeah. That's a really smart business card too. Yeah, awesome. You should get one shaped like a toilet for plumbing. Hey, that would actually be kind of smart if you think about it. I don't know. I'm just wondering why yeah. you guys are doing it. That's all. So I'll tell you a little bit. Yeah. We are I'm not, I'm not being No, no, no. I just want to That's know. fine. Since we were able to joke around a little bit, I'll tell you. So we are exercising our First Amendment rights. We are also reminding people that you're being filmed everywhere you go, every time you leave the house, over a hundred times a day. All right, and that if you want and demand or expect privacy while you are out in public, and that includes eating on a visible area in private that's accessible to the public through the eyes, then the onus and responsibility is on you to create the level of privacy that you want and demand from people. So that's what we've done here. We've created our own privacy. Free speech. Yep. Free press. Free speech, free press, freedom of religion. Why don't you guys say that? Well, we did. I just said I we're no, 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 no. I just said we're expecting. That. Well, it's on my shirt. That. It's like a highlighter. That. It's because if we just give it out, it, we're trying to test to see if our rights are respected. Oh, okay, exactly. Okay. It's an exercise okay. in rights. I'm with you guys. Perfect. A thousand percent. Awesome. Don't even, you know. I appreciate it. You know, it's some other people though. Well, you know, it is what it is. But that's yeah. so. Part of the reason why very few people know our rights in this in this day and age in this country, which is weird is it's not it's no longer in like our education system is failing in massive numbers we're we rank 29th in the world which is ridiculous and I agree a thousand how do you how do you teach so how do you teach people that don't want to listen or didn't learn yeah. you teach them through shock and awe so presenting it in this way okay. the only like if i put this camera on the pole right here nobody would pay any mind to it yeah. But as soon as it's attached to a person dressed like this, guess what? They're going to pay attention. They're going to ask questions. They're going to respond to it. They're going to freak out and run away. Yeah. It, it's a shock and awe. But I guarantee you, those people that ran away, they're going to go inside. They're going to have a conversation. At some point, somebody's going to tell them what happened today. So we have educated them even without having to educate them. Yeah. 
But yeah, that's what we're doing out here. That's all I want, you know, because sometimes you get people. You're fine, but there's a reason we make people ask multiple times. And part of part of that is because we've gone into explaining and sharing with somebody who came off really good in the beginning and yeah, then just yeah, yeah. flipped the script and started screaming and yelling and assaulting uh, us. And so we actually test people a little bit to see if they actually really want to know or if they just want to know because they want to respond to it. So. Okay, all right. I appreciate it. No, no, no. I didn't know, you know. I didn't. No, you're look, all good. I see guys, they're filming stuff, you know, skateboarding. Yep. And in my opinion, if you're not being destructive, skate wherever you want. Absolutely. You know, I'm a big... That's what yeah. I'm saying. And, you know, I'm, I'm for that. A lot of people would be like, why are you for that when it's, you know, it's destructive? It's, I can see... Because I'd rather them be doing that than out there yeah. graffiti in the exactly. world. <laughs> exactly. 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 Trying so, to skate somewhere dangerous yeah. and hurting themselves. But, yeah, exactly, but. exactly. So you know what? Yeah, no, I'm, I'm absolutely for what you guys are doing. I appreciate that. You know, as long as it's going to a good cause. Absolutely, I appreciate it. I love your candor, and no, you know. No, yeah, it's just <laughs> nothing nefarious, you know. Just nothing nefarious. Just some pictures, videos. Yeah. Now I know you look like you don't need a haircut because you look fabulous, by the way. But <laughs> that that, no, that business I'm card. At this. I'm. Uh, I'm impressed by this. Guy. Yeah, it's a I few like doors a down. Now, they weren't really polite life. to us, but we're still promoting them because every small business deserves a chance. So, Why, why weren't they polite? Oh, uh, they we, weren't, we were literally just walking by, and she came out and screamed at us about filming in public. So I was like, all right, no, it is what it is. Yeah. But hey, they got a cool business card. Yeah, but they yeah, do have that, so we had to give them that. Yeah. But Nobody's called anybody on you guys? Oh, we've had the police call like 10 times already, okay, but they're not going to do anything or respond to it. We're not doing anything unlawful. No, 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 no. It just sucks because when the police come, they tell the people, well, unfortunately, they're allowed to do that, which is a really bad missed opportunity for the law enforcement to educate people on their rights by using the word unfortunate. So it's like in their eyes, they're spreading these, this fearful notion that our rights are unfortunate. And it sucks, but, you know. What was your name? My name is Brian. Brian? My yeah. name is Mike. Mike, nice to meet you. Likewise. Nice to meet I'm sorry you. about I just wanted to see what was going on. No, no, it's no, just, you know. Right. Here. I'm just, you know, relaxing. We have about 200 interactions a day, so we gauge kind of how interactions go based on our experiences. Yeah. You have changed my mind on how you approach us. It's great. Yeah, it's yeah, fine. Yeah, it is no, what no, it is. No, no. I just wanted to know. Absolutely. Again, I fully understand. When I first saw you guys, I didn't, I didn't see your shirt. I thought it was for something like skateboarding or, you know, something... You know, just I wish I was young enough to jump on a board. If yeah. I did that right now, I'd so break my hip. that's all I thought it was. I was like, hey, you know what? I'm for that. You yeah. know? But I'm even more for what you guys are about. So I appreciate that, you man. You have a wonderful day. Yeah. You have a blessed safe, day. Yep. Right. And I really do love your hair. <laughs> <laughs> the two-tone thing works. <laughs> I, I can't help it, man. I can't. Hey, hey, hold on. At least it grew like if I if mine grew like that, I'd still be getting oh, yeah, all the women. Mine just turned color. mine just turned I white. Can't help it, you know. Mine just turned white. It's yeah. just, you know. Hey, at least I mean, what am, I'm not going to be like, you know, you guys are, you know, exposing everything for real. I can't, yeah. you know, you know, put something in my hair look like the shoe shine. Yeah, shine, right. You know, it looks <laughs> well, it's fake. What age do you think I went completely gray? All of it. You got to tell me how old are you? 30, well, I'm in my early 40s, but okay. at 33 years old, I lost all my color in my hair. Really? It just went completely gray. I've known gray. a few people like That's that. That's crazy. It, it made me kind of sad because I actually really loved my hair. I used to have long hair. I'd yeah. dye it, color it, all that. And then it went just white, and I'm like, bruh. <laughs> you know, nowadays, nobody cares. Oh, I know. It's, like, it is what it is. Can, you are what you are. That's it. You know what Absolutely. I mean? You have a wonderful day. All right, guys. Thank you. Good luck. Thank you. You have a good one. That looks like a good ass sandwich right there. <laughs> yep. Back up. We got a sandwich bite coming up. Yum. Look at the puppy. As he's like, damn girl, I'm all, look at the puppy. <laughs> I like, damn girl, you're getting fun of my son. When you get to a when you get to a certain age, the you know, as much as I love ass and tits, it it it, it just doesn't affect you the same anymore it's about that personality <laughs> somebody back there trying on a wedding dress or is that a mannequin <laughs> she hasn't moved what the fuck no, it's a, that's a real person. oh it moved holy oh, crap hey. bro a mannequin, dude. 
she was not moving whatsoever. Wait, what is that? Hi, you guys are frosting these windows, right? For what? Are you frosting the windows? We're frosting the windows? Is that what you guys are here for? No. no. Oh. We're just filming everybody inside. Like in our store? Yep. What is oh. that? Frosting the windows? What is that? Oh, we have somebody coming to like frost our windows. Oh, like just to like, okay, like for tent and stuff like that. Gotcha. Okay, great. For tent? To like, put an actual tent? Or is like, it like that artwork stuff? No, like tent. Just tent. Tent. Outside, yeah. well, that's kind of cool. Yeah. Is but, this like for a show or something? No. Uh -uh. Can I ask what it's for? We don't disclose that while we're working. Okay. They're just filming women try dresses on? No, we're not. We're not in their dressing rooms. I'm just. We're filming with the ongoings of all the stores as we go we're by. The whole stuff. That's a weird way to phrase us filming in public. I mean, you that's what you said. He said he's filming inside. So we have I am. I'm filming people. inside. I'm filming the people, but I haven't seen into any dressing rooms. That's not our. That's not our intent. Okay, let's just double check. That'd be weird. I mean, if your if your dressing rooms are open to the windows, that'd be kind of weird too, though. Right. They're not. It's okay. just we do have women doing kind of private appointments, like right in this section. So I was just making. Alright, well, as, long, as long as they're store. behind walls, then they'll be fine. Great. Okay. Alright. She did not like when I said that. I thought we were here to frost the windows. <laughs> we're actually here to do the opposite. Right? <laughs> so, apparently they're getting the windows frosted, she called. I think that's called window tint. But, um, apparently they're getting that done, so we can't do what we do through the windows. Um, that's just kind of funny. Um, we got here a little sooner than they did, but she asked if we're filming them changing into wedding dresses or trying on wedding dresses. No, we might film them in their wedding dress, but not in various state of being undressed. The heck? Terminator. No. That's, a, no, that's, that's Boba Fett. Boba Fett? Yeah. That was really fast. And the only reason I can see them is because I'm standing and I've created a shadow and it's letting yeah, me see them. I, legit, I had to do that earlier at the restaurant to get a shot of it. Damn, that shit's right all over the sidewalk. Yeah. I just got recorded without my consent. Oh, and there's another one right there. Look at that. They got a bougie version of the ring doorbell. Oh yeah, they got one right there and then there's another one right over there. Holy crap. that on camera. Fucking with people? Oh, fuck with you, ma'am. You got you need a bib next time you eat though. You got water all over your. Check out watermelon here. I love it. Like the style.
Absolutely, thank you. How are you beautiful ladies doing today? Good. That's good, that's good, that's good. You guys have a wonderful day. Sorry? What are you doing? I cannot hear you. You're talking really quietly. You having fun? Yes, all day. Good. I'm a professional photographer, so. Uh, I'm glad to hear that. Enjoy. And I really love your hat. You have a good day, buddy. Hi there. What's that? I can't hear you. So you're talking really quietly, but so we don't we don't have to ask permission. Number one, number two, that would require me to then go on to private property, which we're not, I'm not trying to do that. There's no problem. I certainly. Get I appreciate you giving me permission, but um, just so you understand, that would require us to then go on to private property, and we're not really allowed to do that. So, can I ask what you guys are doing? So we don't really disclose that while we're working, but we've been nothing but cordial and nice to everybody. And why are you doing it? I can't hear you. Why are you doing this? Everyone. So I have traffic right behind me. You got to speak up just a little bit so I can hear it. Why are we doing this? So I can't really disclose that while we're working. Okay, then, then you can move on. What happened? Then you can move on. No, no, I have to stay here for the next three hours. We can't wait on. on. There, there you go. There, this is, uh, you can't be here. This is a store. We got business to be going on. Okay. You're blocking people. For I'm actually night. not. So people. You're blocking the chat. This, right. this guy got to go in. So you guys got to keep on. Hey, so he can get out. Several people have come in and got out. We're not blocking well, anybody. No what happened? There's no reason for you to be recording. We don't, we don't there is a reason. You just don't know it. What is your reason then? I'm not going to share that with you. Okay, then you're not going to be here. So move on. Please. I'm not moving on. I'm staying right here. All right. Either you move on or we're trying to call the cops. You can call the police. You can call the police. Okay. Hi. Is the idea that because you don't have to ask, you won't politely ask? No, no. So here's the problem is, so we are not allowed to go on to private property while conducting our business. So to get permission, I well, would you, have you to go. simply call in. Is it okay if I shoot a picture? You said if I call in? No, if you simply, if you just I can't do that because most of the business's doors are closed and this is just happens to be the only one open. What if they tell us no? If I said no? No, what if we called them and they said no? Yeah, what if they say no? Well, I'm not saying call in. No, I'm, I'm asking you. No, what, no, but let's say, let's say I called in and I said, hey, can I film? And they say no, then what? Well, then what? I'm going to film anyways. That's it. That's it. So, how you doing? Come on in. You're allowed to record. You're not allowed to lock the doors during business hours. That's violation of fire code. Four. There's four of us. There's five of us. Oh, five. Five of us. He's filming too. Sir, it would be polite if you asked me to take a picture. We got five cameramen here. That's not polite, sir. It's not polite, sir. That's very I know it's your right. I know it's your right, but it's not polite. It's very impolite. It's very impolite. Sir, did you even bother asking for my permission? So your logic only works for you? Nick. So you can do it, but we can't. So your logic only works for you? Hi Facebook, we love you. What Facebook group is this going in? Send me a link. That's all right. People will send it to us anyways. We always get it sent to us when they post it. You can't lock the door. That's a fire hazard. She created a fire hazard during business hours. Are they not open? No. They are. They just locked the door. Oh, well, it looks like now they're open. They just don't know the fire code. It's actually a violation when they lock the door and keep lock clients Every in the time you do uh, it, it's store. One. It is, each each time is a fire violation caught on camera. Oh, 
Here you go. Not another fire hazard. All right, guys, so here at Ace Hardware today, we have all the staff at the front of the store. Nobody can get any help in the back. Just put that out there. All right, guys, we're here with the uh, Long Beach Observer today. We got Lizard Media and we got Simple Media over here. All of these beautiful souls. Make sure to give them some support. Someone honking me? Hi there. Hello. Who's honking their truck? Hi, guys. You're on candy camera. Why are you guys honking at us? Bye guys. I like your truck. It is a very beautiful truck though. You guys have a good day. Thank you for painting. It's a good job. Thank you. Haha, -ha, he's got it. Hey, good job. Educate. Keep doing it. Keep doing it. Good job. We're down the whole staff right now. Good job. Looks like this guy has a... Uh, he's a fan. You know he watches these videos. This guy knows his stuff. He's educating all the staff here. Look, there's one person right here. Another person right there. This guy is educating everybody in there. He's telling them all to stop being Karens. It only takes one good apple to start the movement. Good job. Stop being Karens. That's what you got to get that message out. We are the anti-Karen movement. Anti and I feel really bad for everybody whose name is actually Karen. Yeah. yeah he's still yelling at him a little bit. Like he's kind of got his voice up. He's like, bro, like you guys got to stop. You can't do anything about it. He just said they just want reaction. You guys gave it to all of them. Nothing you can do. It's public. Yep, he's doing it again. Damn, he's, he's having this conversation like three times. That's an educated guy right there. <laughs> he said open the door. Hey, good job, buddy. That was beautiful. I heard most of it. Good job on educating your your fellow staff mates. What an American. That is That's an American. that is good. They all freaked out, said they're calling the cops about a First Amendment protected activity. I'm glad you educated them. The fear has gone away. You guys that's a good job to help teach them to be able to not be Karen's. Kind of walk away from being a Karen. It's not a good act. She is right now. It's okay, guys. Look. So she's really upset that you're right right now, but that's all right. That's good job, my friend. That's a long way. Now we'll go. You have a good day. Thank you. Ace worker, his, how he educated his staff, got them all to come down. He was doing it with a smile, but also being very firm, telling them, don't be stupid, don't be a Karen. He's like, just walk away, let them go, open the door. They will go away. <laughs> he is a Superman. And I appreciate it. Hopefully he watches our channel someday and sees it. He's amazing. He needs to pass on that education to his kids. How you doing, sir? Good. What do you think of the, the, the poles to lock your bikes to? They're really good. That's good, good. You seem very safe. You have a wonderful day. Thank you. Free speech, First Amendment. Fuck All yeah. day long, brothers. You have a good day, guys. God bless you guys. Up, Absolutely. You have a good Stay day. Safe. Great to see you out there. Keep it up. Good hey. work. Thank you guys so much. What's the uh, channel? So, normally I don't hand it out. Okay. Uh, while we're out here, who do you watch right now? Dude, I've seen SGB and a few others on there. Right. You have your YouTube app? I do. I'll punch it in for you, and okay. you can share it with this guy. And yeah, keep me up. <laughs> fall behind, bro. You can't fall behind. Are you? you? Can't fall behind these days. Uh, no, and it's, it's so fast up. too. <laughs> you gotta stay you on it. Blink once, the whole world is gonna buy you. All right, here, uh, I'll let her hold that for a second. Yeah, I kind of look like you guys riding my bike here. Huh? <laughs> like it. All right, so I went ahead and I subscribed you. You got it, brother. Uh, it'll, start, you guys. it'll start showing up on your feed. Good deal. You have a wonderful day. You guys hey, do the same, man. Be safe. All right, be safe, safe, guys. Let's go on that Supreme Court case in the First Amendment right now. Which one? Right now, today. There's three. The, the, not the Missouri v. Biden, but the, uh, uh, they just they did, did the arguments, oral arguments yesterday. 
And what was what did it have to do with which one? New York. It was about New York. It was about the government reaching out and trying to slap down uh, businesses because they were uh, talking about things that they didn't that the government didn't think they were talking about. Okay. They, that, that they shouldn't be talking about. The government thought that there was COVID stuff being misinformation about. or it was, it was misinformation. Okay. And a Supreme Court justice actually said to the attorneys defending the free speech that the Supreme Court justice actually said, well, I'm a little concerned about your point of view because it seems like it hamstrings the government from being able to do what we need to do. And I'm thinking, wow. the First Amendment hamstrings the government? That's, That's what crazy. it's supposed to do. That's crazy. Right? It absolutely. That, that to is, it is, it's That's literally exactly made that way by design. To right. do that to protect us, right? So I'll look into that one. I've actually been following two others. Which one? Um, so one of them, it hasn't made it to Supreme Court yet, but the state of Washington, the, the Washington uh, Supreme, uh, Supreme Court. State Supreme Court? Yeah, that one. <laughs> so, um, they just ruled against freedom of press. Uh, so right now, under the First Amendment, Anybody who picks up a phone is becomes press. Like that, the, it's a free yeah. nation where anybody can become press to disseminate anything that they want. Yeah, and they just restricted that. They took the word press away from each individual and gave it to the corporate media. Yeah, and so uh, we're keeping an eye on that one because that should be picked up by the Supreme Court. Missouri, it will be reversed so if they hold that to. Missouri v. Biden is the other one. That's the big one. I think Missouri v. Biden is the one that's going to do it. Yeah, yeah. The one yesterday, it was about it was the um, NRA. And the NRA was providing, like, uh, some type, not really insurance, but coverage for people that own weapons and need yeah. legal help or whatever. Yeah. And New York uh, and the Washington, D.C. and the Biden administration were trying to slap the NRA down and not let banks do banking with them, take them off of social media cancel all their stuff because they said their message is about guns being safe is a bad message right you know i i don't care what you believe in i don't care if you're pro-gun not pro-gun pro-abortion not pro whatever it is yeah in this country we're in a free nation and we really should just mind the fuck out of all of our own businesses less government the amazing thing was they gave these they had like 150 emails between the government and businesses where the government says, if you crack down on these people, we won't go as hard as you. Yep. If you stop you know, working with these people, we'll take it easy. We could be hard on you, we're gonna take it easy and not do anything. So they're like coercing yep. It's a tit for tat, it, it always has been. Because they didn't like these, what these other yep. guys say about yep. pro-gun. And like I don't care what politics care. everybody leans in, at the end of the day, my thing is, I support small politics, local politics. Yeah. I honestly, you know, when it comes to presidential elections nowadays, it's, one rich guy against another rich guy. We need to somehow figure out how to take massive uh, super PACs just out of the, just yes, yes, money right. needs to be taken away from you know presidential about. elections. Literally and it needs to be placed back with the people. Who's and right now you could buy an election and it's, it, yep. it's just fact. Yep. Great, uh, best free speech guy on the internet is uh, Mitt Romney as a hologram on Twitter. Well, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> You, you have a blessed day. Hold on, guys. Nice to meet you. Likewise. Keep up the work. Be safe. All right, we'll see you guys. All right, brother. School clock dial that used to be on a clock and now is no longer, but it is a piece of decoration that I really want in my hallway. Do what? <laughs> We're not gonna yell it. Damn. We're not gonna yell it. Did you wanna know? I thought you asked us a question. Huh? I can barely hear you. There's loud traffic right behind us. What are we doing? We're videoing. Just random? Huh? Just random? You could say that, so we don't disclose what we're doing while we're working, but. Okay. Huh? We're running a business. And I was only talking nice about your business. I was complimenting the clock thing over there. Yeah. Uh, but, didn't you know. Come back until you so, us. well, I think it was the other one, but either way, like, you guys are being really rude and for no reason. Right. Huh? 
by yelling at us when we're two stores down and then making us walk back over here while they run back inside. How you doing? I love your beard. So my, my, my wife told me I have to wear my best face when I leave the house. So she doesn't like my other one. So this is what I get. <laughs> you guys have a wonderful day. Be blessed. Wait, when's the first day of spring? Today is the first day of spring. I missed it. How did I miss it? What do we have here? It's a toy store. Cool toy store. That is amazing. Well, I love your smile. I love your attitude. It's really good. I like yours too. I know. My wife told me how to wear my best face when I leave the house. Oh, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, thanks for stopping by. And thank you for being so kind. You have to be kind. Absolutely. You, you, you need to tell more people that. Because the, some some of them aren't. Why? We're nothing. We we offer joy to anybody who gives us joy. Why? And some people just come out screaming and yelling about it, you know yelling at us for no reason. We're not we're not we're not doing anything political. Nothing like that. We're literally just practicing our First Amendment rights to film in public and we make videos and oh disseminate our interactions with people. And you've done an oh, amazing job. Oh no, I'm gonna be on. You're gonna yes, but me. yes, you are gonna be disseminated. But <laughs> it's gonna be really good. You've been wonderful. No, unlike these other. Okay, well, You're where, doing well. where will I beat the seminary? <laughs> <laughs> so, um, you know, do you have your phone on you? I do. You have YouTube? Yeah. If you want, do you watch YouTube a lot or no? Not really. I like watching vi videos of gardening. Okay, then you're definitely not going to enjoy my videos, but <laughs> it is what it is. But it, you're going to come out really good. So. Okay. Well, good. We love you. Thank you, you for you've been wonderful. By. Absolutely. Thank you. Enjoy your gardening though. Life's short and that's a very... It's springtime. Everybody's going to love gardening. So, well, right? the thing is, so gardening, I find peaceful as well. Yeah. And it's a very zen thing. The fact that you said that, it's very zen. No wonder you're so zenful. It's I'm zenful. You know, your hobbies are, you know, I want to disseminate perfectly. zenfulness. Yes. That is, <laughs> my name is Mike. Mike, thank you. You have a blessed day. Where will I find you? Uh, oh, if you want, I'll put it on your no, YouTube. Just tell me. Uh, so we're Impact Media. Impact Media. Two eyes, no A on YouTube. Two eyes, no A. On Impact. Okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> on YouTube. Yeah. I, I, I. M P C T. Yep. All right. Have a beautiful day, you guys. You too, and thank beautiful. you for being so beautiful. Oh. Like you radiate kindness and love, and that's amazing. Well, we're a great toy store. So. Absolutely. I'll go on. Thank you so much. Do you guys do shipping too? Awesome. All right. You like my shirt? I do. I appreciate that. I do. I appreciate I like that. Because that's what we're face. out here doing. I like your hat. I know. Face. I can't. My, my wife will not let me leave the house without my smile on. What about these guys? Where are their smiles? So these are my sons. They haven't earned their smiles yet. Oh. <laughs> Sorry? They're somewhere out here. Oh, okay. All right. All right. You have a blessed day. All right, you guys Thank you so much. Back. I love your smile. Amen. I love how kind you've come out. Amen. You know, we all up the same up in here. We're all sinners. We're all we all need help. We need a savior. and kindness. We need kindness more than help right you now. You know what? We need more than kindness. And well, we need more than help. Yeah, we need a lot more. We need a lot more. <laughs> we need a lot more. We need the blood of Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> he comes closer than white on rice. Is that what you're drinking? You right know, now? it's coming. This is coffee okay. from the reborn, right. but you need to be reborn, uh, born again. Yeah, you got ah! me on that one. So when are you going to start your own church? Well, because you know that's where that's where the real success in life church is. Church sucks. <laughs> church is full of hypocrites and greedy <laughs> business people who aren't as smart as you or me. But somehow their family, their father was the pastor, because they, so they they're good at speaking. That's it. That's but, it. Um, the, the gift of gab. No, but the, the church, the body, the body of Christ is in the people who know Christ, and most of the church don't know Christ. That's that, <laughs> that, that is money. fact. That is Come fact. Come back on Sunday. Yeah, that you is know, fact. They scream at you about them, but they don't so know. So it's that. unfortunate. So it's you know. We're still lost, though. We still need a savior. Though. Absolutely. We just don't go to church for most of the time. <laughs> absolutely. I appreciate your Read kindness. Read the Bible. Pray. God told me uh, just yesterday. He said, "You know, Brian." I know you've been a Christian for 15 years, but I'm going to tell you now. I said, what, God? He said, all you can do is pray for people, man. And guess what? After you pray for them, 
That's all you. Well, it's not just that. So you're not God. This, this. Really, I'm not. He's like, yeah. It took you a while to figure that out. You are not God. So not the last control. couple weeks, I've actually had people anger pray with it, like at us. So kindness has to be part of spreading that message. Is like, you know, we have to be way kinder to one another. Well, the fruit of the spirit is love, joy, peace, and kindness. Almost right, none right, of them spread that. Right? Huh? Oh, shit! So, I'm, I'm a big supporter, right? I'll say with you guys. I follow, <laughs> uh, yeah, here, let me shake your hand, man. I follow Casey Camera Boy. I think, I think it was with him a couple days ago. Yep, right? absolutely. Yeah, like you you got to get on uh, Long Beach Observer right oh, here. Yeah, Long Beach Observer. I think I follow yep. you too, actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And these are my two, two sons. sons right? yeah. yeah. Hey, thank you so much oh, again. Yeah, I got to get this. Thank you so much. Absolutely. crazy. You guys are superstars. Hey, getting there. But it's thanks to people like him that get us there, you know what I mean? So that's good. People. People. Yeah. People. Yeah. People business, man. Relationships. He came up just to say hello. Yeah. Absolutely. I think he pulled over just to say hi to you. And yeah, he recognized he you. Yeah. Which is which is hard to do with this on. <laughs> that's so cool. Uh Brian is your name? Brian. My name is Jack. Jack. I appreciate your kindness. Yeah, man. Thank you so much. I myself am agnostic, but you are the perfect embodiment of somebody who wants to share their their religious beliefs with somebody you did it the you did it the perfect way and i appreciate that and you're the judge of all mankind so i appreciate I, that thank I mean, you very much we got the man here you know these are real people 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 we need help that we know we do How in do every way it? possible took me a while <laughs> i got three duis and a hit and run oh no then i said god if you're real save me i'll serve you and i was born again in my mom's house no church yeah then i went to the church and i got a little messed up <laughs> but it took me a little while to get off the religion to get into like oh I had you everything. Do not need religion to have a spiritual religion. relationship you know, with your God. I don't think it was the religion def I I was all good at home. But you know what? But then I read the Bible, so the, it gave me the Bible. Gotta read the Bible, you know, and then pray. Basics. Basics. Agnostic means So it's just the belief that, you know, um I don't disbelieve in religion. I just kind of believe I'm on my own adventure to find, you know, uh, what it is that I want to believe. I have a spiritual relationship with myself right now. Um, I'm, I have kind of ears open to the ground. I, I, I've learned about many religions. Um, a lot of people, you know, they, they, they kind of, even just yesterday, so somebody shared with me that, you know, Christianity is the only religion. Every, every other one is fake and false. And how, who determines that? You know what I mean? How, how are you, how do you label somebody's faith? and their belief in god like how do you label that with a religious box and judge and, it and yeah and, and then the and then and then it. keep them in it and then be the authority and tell them tell everyone else they're doing it wrong uh, it, it's just so i'm on a path of my own little enlight, right. enlightenment you can Ain't call about it. no education we need some more revelation you and, know what i mean and if kindness god, and god love needs to show and, you he yeah. needs to show me for 28 years i did not know what i did not know yeah. And then after that, God revealed himself. He revealed his light, and then I changed. Well, how am I going to go out there and talk to someone else he hasn't revealed his light to and judge? Like, like I earned it, and so now I'm going to tell you, no, what happened? It takes a little patience. It takes a little mercy. I ain't God, but now I know him, and that's what people are trying to do. They're trying to know God, yeah. So, but until he reveals himself to them, yeah. hey, I don't know Donald Trump. heard about him. Yeah. I, don't, I don't have a personal relationship with him. Yeah. Can't get to him. So Jesus Christ came as a man to go get after us. But now there's timing involved. And thank God he gives us time, right? Yeah. I mean, oh, don't yeah. we want choice? Don't yeah. we want time? Yeah. I mean, no one can steal. That's what they're stealing from us in this country and oh, everything, yeah. right? <laughs> Everywhere, in this, yeah. In this video, everything. Yeah. We want the choice. And something about letting someone have their choice draws them in. Yeah. Because they're like, man, I used to be drunk and on drugs, and then in one night he saved my life, but I know the price, the blood of Jesus Christ. You know, now he sticks close like white on rice. No, it's all good. But until then, you know, I pray for you guys. I pray in Jesus' name that he would reveal his light to you. And guess what? God said that's all I can do. Yeah. So And that's the perfect version God. of prayer. Because I'm not it. God. That is perfect. I, I wish I could. You know, I wish I could bling, bling, blong, blong. Oh, all right. Hey, I wish I would just do, the world do would be me. would different <laughs> if it was like that. Bro, bro, we want the journey. It's not the destination, you know? It's the journey. So. You have a blessed hey, day, man. my friend. Be blessed. Thank you for being so kind. And keep sharing that. Keep sharing that.
That's you know, do uh, you have your phone on you? Yeah. I'll, you have the YouTube app? Yeah. I'll punch it in. Here, Alex. Again. Take the picture. I don't yeah. usually share this with people, okay. but. We're just taking some pictures. She's really kind. You uh, and the first story. Amazing. She is a whole different level of kindness. So, what was the fact media the two eyes I just described to you? Um, we disseminate our interactions with people throughout as we travel the nation. Um, we're leaving again on Monday to go uh, to Florida again on a long road trip. We go to each town. We do this. We meet people. We have conversations. We disseminate our experiences in our channel. And we are one of the fastest growing platforms right now. So, um, not all of them are good. Not all of them are great. You, if you watch one of our videos, you know, it'll blow your mind. In fact, so the one from yesterday is uh, right here. Watch this one and see how people are doing religion wrong because yesterday was all about that. Yeah. Where people were anger praying at us. Yeah. Yeah. Um, now we did get we did get some like sharing kindness, she was about to cry. That's how, that's a great example of how to operate within your spiritual realm and share that with people. What she did here today was I find that amazing. That's and awesome. That. Thank, Thank you. you. Right? I do. You have that's so cool. You have a good day, man. Thank you. You have a good one. How you guys doing? Hey, Don. Are you first amendment auditors? Holy shit! Welcome. <laughs> Welcome. Hopefully, I will see your YouTube channels. Beautiful. Yeah. You know what? Thanks for everybody me. has a right to do whatever they. Um, Brother, you came out. Uh, you, you did it right, man. This is good. Good job, man. I appreciate your smile. I appreciate your kindness, and yeah. Oh, you're welcome. Anyone giving you grief at all? Um, actually, a good chunk of the day, but I will say this: the gentleman at the mattress store. Beautiful to us. The toy store, beautiful to us. Really good guys. Oh yeah, no, they were great to us. And we've had a few other great ones, but we've had mostly people losing their mind on us, but that's okay. Everybody gets to have their own experience with us. And hey, you know who I like? I like that guy from New York, uh, Jason. Have a Gansu Press? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Press. Yeah, yeah. Have, have Gansu Press here. So with we, Watchdog or whatever. Yeah, <laughs> so we Watch actually Watchdog. operate pretty much the same exact way. So if you go on YouTube, First Amendment Auditing, you'll find us at some point. Watch out for the Karens around here. Oh, there's a lot. Oh, yeah. we, we've got, we, we captured them in our camera today. Oh, you did? <laughs> a lot. Oh, that's yeah. Good. Yeah. <laughs> you have a beautiful day, my friend. Yeah, too. Thank Bye. you so much. Yeah, nice to finally meet some auditors. Yeah. Hey, yeah, that too. Be blessed, man. What in the heck was that? Is it, yeah, I, I got the very little bad bit of that on camera, but um, oh, psychic spot. Let's see if they can predict uh, while we're here. <laughs> <laughs> I think she's. Like, I'm gonna go ahead and see if uh, I can predict why we're here. They're also exercising their first amendment right. Hello. Did you know we were coming? <laughs> that was a good answer. <laughs> well, at least the weather's working for you guys. So. Yeah, that's true. The other day was thundering, stormy, and freezing. Right. Thankfully. <laughs> yeah, I love it. Nice. I love your office, though. Thank you. It's very zen. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The energy. You have a blessed day. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Absolutely. Thank you so much. Thank you. You have a wonderful day. Oh, we're here at Mark. There. Give myself a bunch of backgrounds. There's about 14 grown ass men in there, and they're all freaking out like they're a bunch of three year old toddlers. That's <laughs> crazy. Oh, he looks very mad. Uh oh. Is that Mark himself? Why are you so mad? Jeez. Yeah. What the fuck you want? Huh? What do you want? I want you to calm down. You gotta bring it down a notch. What are you doing? I'm not gonna share that with you. What are you doing? I'm not telling you. What are you doing? I'm not telling you. Why are you so mad? Why are you so mad, sir? I don't know, I'm gonna call backup though. 
You called the Phillies patrol? Why are they on their way? What's that? Because we have masks on? They're not going to do anything about masks. You ever heard of privacy? They, they wear masks too. Are you upset? Sir, we just want to take pictures of your rings. Is that okay? Then why would you put it in front of a glass window? Actually, this is public property. They're, they're, then why would you put it in front of a glass wall? They're in front we of, can film them. I'm allowed to film them. Your rings are in front of public property. I'm actually, I'm currently filming them. So why can't I take a picture of it? And who you are don't, you? You don't get to say that. Are you my dad? You're not my dad. You don't tell me what to do. You don't tell me what to do. You don't have a dad. Damn. <laughs> He's projecting. Are you projecting? Uh, it's okay, sir. I don't know. Walking it's around okay, walking around that angry, I really hope you don't have kids, because that's a lot of abusive energy you get there. We do everyone. You know if, you know if you really wanted if you really wanted to have a conversation, you could open the door and we could have a conversation. Over there. Alright, she's coming in, she's coming in. Gonna get out soon. Here's the cops. They are, they did show up for him. Are they gonna come here? She yep, they're coming. He was about to pull over and then saw us. I know, like it, the little, the tiniest little red zone <laughs> parked in it. Good afternoon. You parked in the smallest red zone I've ever seen in my life. No. I, almost, I almost made it in the parking spot. Oh, shoot. That's the smallest red zone. <laughs> How are you doing? I'm doing wonderful. How are you doing today? Fabulous. Fabulous. Your badge is a little worn. It is. It's because I'm old. You need a new one. Yeah. Maybe one day. Maybe one day. <laughs> yeah, I've never seen a two-digit badge number. No, it's not but they'll get, you get a new one when you get sergeant, right? You do. Perfect. Are you going to go for sergeant? No. No? Too much work? Not enough pay? How are we doing today? Doing wonderful. Just, just trying to get in people's faces today? Actually, we're not. We're doing the opposite. We've been leaving everybody well, I alone. Why should say get in people's faces? Maybe uh, push people's buttons. Not that either. What? So we actually, if you go talk to the mattress store and all the other people that have been nothing but really nice to us. Other than the jewelry store. They yeah, had a complete jewelry. meltdown. We're cussing and screaming at us. We were there for three and a half minutes and it was just fucking chaos the whole time. So can you explain to me just for curiosity's sake what, what our purpose is? So I'm not going to disclose that because okay. every time that I have done that in the past, the they decide to put it all out over dispatch and tell everybody what we're doing and you I'm, know i don't care so yeah. i was just curious yeah I'm curious why we don't have anything else to do so i'm retired recently actually four years ago thanks to them but yeah they're they got you retired yep kids got you retired absolutely wow they're my kids by the way oh there you go so they actually took over my company for me four years ago okay retired me yeah that's so what now I do. we're just walking around putting cameras and faces so you you keep saying that but that's actually opposite of what we do so we stand back and people put their well, you face. Got like six in mine. But they put you their face. Well, that's because we. No, I'm here actually. Yeah. You're you, no, no, but you're a little different. You are law enforcement, so we are actually gonna, you know, meet you halfway versus you having to come and approach us. Is it like a YouTube channel thing or? So we can't we share that with you either. Well, then how are you supposed to promote yourself? Well, I don't usually promote myself to anybody who asks on the street. Uh, we're one of the fastest growing platforms. People find us. In fact, we got recognized right in front of the jewelry store. Some guy pulled over, went out of his way to come out and say hey to us. And, you know, people know us. We're well known. I don't. Ah, uh, you will, you will that, someday. Wouldn't, wouldn't that mean you want to introduce yourself to me? No, not, not at really. all. But if you search up, you know, I mean, what, I, I, what I, that? I, that dude threatened me right now. What do you say? The big, Hi! The big dude, he was like pretending like he wants to box up. Yeah, so he's, he keeps cussing yeah, us out. Run out of energy. So really, you guys should have someone go talk to him because... Yeah. He's the one being a belligerent a-hole. And I got it all on film. I, I got it, but yeah. people are still very uncomfortable with cameras. So you say people, so far he's been the only person 
who's well, no, decided to have a meltdown. Like the third time someone's called, and it's not that necessarily I care. It's that yeah. you're messing with my dispatch because they are the only. A few I'm people. not messing with anybody. They are I a few people so and working, when, and then you guys so are generating so many calls when okay. they actually should be taking calls from real emergencies. I ex I actually explain to people when they say well, we're going to call the. So, well, no, when people. Yes, it, clearly. It's not. It's not. It's not my fault. But and it's how it's they're reacting. Us. It's their fault. They create the 911 call. I don't tell them to call 911. In fact, when they say they're going to call 911, I ask them why they're going to do that for a, an activity that we are doing that is lawful. And for what? Like, you know what I mean? Like, you guys are going to go. You're going to educate them. Know that there's you nothing. You know that that's going to happen. You yeah. That, that's why you but do this. We, but no, that's actually generate. not. Officer, we not at all. We don't. Not we to don't. Waste police resources. Yeah. We, 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 we tell, tell them on our to. camera not to do that because it's a waste of police resources. We're not anti law. Why are we wearing masks then? Creating privacy. my own privacy, just like you're allowed privacy. to. You got eight cameras you on. Can me. Well, you can you're create it. You're allowed to, though. Yeah, you're allowed to. So no, like, I, that's actually wrong. So I, we have law enforcement contact last to week. Wear a mask. Okay. How about that? All right. Because Perfect. I'm not scared of my identity. That's a better. I'm not either. Am I. Okay. I am. I'm hiding what, my privacy. What? What if? What if I was a wanted felon and I wanted not to identify, and this is the way I do it? That's a strange question. I'm just saying. But I'm just saying. What? What if? So I had to create my own privacy because you're here been wearing that the whole time so all right i'm just saying no. <laughs> doesn't just have to do with me. but no you so in this country this beautiful world that we live in this you know at least world. this at least this part of it um we are allowed to create our own privacy to the level that we feel that we need when we leave the house and this is what i've done we're being filmed 24 7 that bank the yeah bank over there, i mean the you're library. filming me right now he's filming you're me filming your car is probably I filming me. my face on your camera so I'm creating my own privacy how but you can do that to other people you can create your own absolutely too. but they have they, they all can go hide they don't have to be in front they of the camera. all have the they ability to, to mask up. it in front of their face well we're, we're not we away, right? they, so that's they, okay not away, right? i'm not gonna argue with four people can they walk away anywhere. or not hey. can they walk away or not point of this because okay. you keep generating radio calls regardless other police okay. and it's not okay. us it's other people it, it is actually you whether you want to admit it or not, you guys are doing this for a purpose. Okay. It's to get people's attention. That's actually not, not the true. purpose we're doing. 100% purpose. That's, that's not. You can it's believe that. You're, you're, you're assuming now. Right? You're no, I don't assume that. that. But you also keep not saying. Not everyone else so, walking down the road is getting the police called on them. You also keep telling people or to keep telling us that we're putting cameras in people's faces. We're not doing that at all. We stand back on the curb. They kind of put themselves into our camera. And if you're dispatched. You're in was very public places where yes. people walk by that don't necessarily and that's fine. want to be filmed. Well, that's up. Then they shouldn't be walking out in public. Something Didn't you agree? To do. Because I walked by. So that jewelry store is a perfect example. Look, he has one, two, three cameras that are filming me without my consent on the sidewalk. But it's not okay if I do it back. It's on his private business, though. No, it's not. He's filming the public this sidewalk. Is my private business. Because they're this concerned about people that dress like you that right. go in there. And I'm and concerned. Them. And that's I'm concerned about jewelry about. stores robbing me. They're robbing you of my money when I buy their jewelry. Well, buy their jewelry. That's easy. Okay. Well, this is my security camera. Anything. This is my security camera. Don't come up to the camera. Don't interact with the camera. Am I not allowed to have a security camera? You can just go I back to the okay. bathroom. That's my point. Is you're the ones that are creating this. I'm not creating not. anything. If I'm just existing. Admit it or not. If fine. your dispatch was knowledgeable enough, they would tell every single caller that they have every right to do what they're doing because this is our first amendment. I like right talking to, to the code. one that actually talks. Yeah, because you don't like what I'm telling you. No, it's because you don't like being told the truth, sir. That's, that's it. Okay. It says the 18 year old. Yeah, but you, you, you've you been making. Are you patronizing him? So you, not patronizing. So you, you've been making assumptions, though, since we got here. You all. did. You said we're you, putting cameras you, in people's faces. You just did. You, you said we're doing this just assumption. to get police responses, which is actually incorrect. Not that's You're not. You're doing it to get attention. Not at all. Okay. Not at all. Great. Then have a good day. I I, I, I don't have to go anywhere. You're just going to screw it. I can leave it whenever I want to. Absolutely. Yeah, you're wasting police resources. We love to pay you for that. Well, well, thank you. Appreciate it. Yeah. Tax really payer, you guys are wasting your own. Oh money. hey! I saw her earlier. I'm you're, assuming you're that's the ride along. Is that his mom? I get paid all day. I'm assuming. No, but you're wasting taxpayer money you by sitting here and doing you nothing. You take advantage of people. You don't have to Maybe admit I like it. Hanging out with you, guys. you like doing you nothing. You literally all don't day have long. to admit it. You like hanging out with you. It's new. Well, I don't like hanging out with you. This guy doesn't know what the first thing is. Then you can leave if you want to. This is the most action they've gotten all week. No, I can't. Okay. Are you upset because we're taking pictures in public? I'm not upset at anything. You seem really upset. What makes me upset? I just don't I'm understand why we talk people out of calling the police and you're telling us we're wasting police resources. You guys are purpose. the ones wasting. Not that purpose. Okay. You're you assuming that. You're Fine. assuming based on your experiences yeah, maybe with other people so. doing similar activities. So, but officer, that's just like me saying every cop right. is bad. That's like me saying every cop is bad. Is that a fair assumption yeah, for me to say every cop is bad? I never said you were bad. 
You said, so but you're, you're assuming, human. you're assuming why I'm doing this. You are assuming why I'm doing this. You know what I'm assuming. Because you literally you said it. You said I'm, you said I'm doing this for attention. That's not an assumption. It is an assumption. You made an assumption of what my assumption is. Ooh, where we are now. Wow, hey, look at that. He's a child. Don't answer him. Have a good day. Have a better one. This match number 63 does That's not an insecure like the Hold on, are you the mom right along? This is pretty cool. Hey folks, you keep going because that truck's trying to come through. Thanks. I want you to run over, you know? Yeah, we're Still in a red zone, by the way. Long Beach Observer. Hey, what's this about? He's actively wasting police Look at resources. Right bye bye. Who left first, huh? He's Who not leaving. First? He's just pulling forward. Two. Three, four, five, six, another. Give me another. Seven. One more. One more. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Fifteen and a half. Sixty. <laughs> <laughs> you got like twenty now. <laughs> that was great. Jerks. It sounded like nerds. Yeah, I heard nerds. Uh, this lady is hyper concerned about us right now. Please do not film me. What happened? Please do not film me. We're already filming you. Please do. Why are you filming me? What's that? Why are you filming me? Because you're here? But you're on public property. I'm on public property. Please do not film me. i already filmed you. That was weird. Hi guys. Do you mind me asking what you guys are doing? Ah, uh, we're just doing public filming. Okay. Getting people's reactions, see if they're emotionally mature enough to handle it. You guys are doing great. Thank you. you get, your Happy parents raised you right. You guys have a wonderful day. You too. Yep. Is she following us? Wow. Ladies and following us is the gas station. She's on the phone. Montana. This chick is crazy. What the hell? <laughs> what are you guys recording? Oh, just doing public photography. Awesome. You guys have a wonderful, blessed day. Thank you. Did you call 911 because you are scared of four masked men and then follow them Come on, to their next location? 
something's not right there. Trigger words women like to use because they want to see results. Now this chick's just blocking the whole ass road. Just Hold it exactly, bro. I knew it. I see the flag, man. That's too much. That is crazy. What are, what are they doing, though? Hello. How you guys doing? Good things. How are you? Wonderful. Oh, we don't need any help yet. We're not we're not going to come in yet. We're going to come in in a few minutes, but okay. right now we're just filming the outside of the library talking about how, you know, how beautiful it is and well, Thank you. Yeah. Let me know if I can help you with anything. My name's Nadia. I'm the branch librarian. Oh, I appreciate it. No, we're going to come in and film in there in a few minutes um, and then yeah, we'll be out of here. Thank you. What happened? Hey. <laughs> Fuck, I didn't hear what he said. Uh oh. Um, um, guys to your left. The what? The only people we're causing havoc with apparently is the police, so we're not, uh, yeah. But I'm assuming, just on your looks, that you agree with us doing that part, so we're good. <laughs> no, no problem. We're also causing havoc on this guy apparently, because he was really butthurt about us filming. I'd rather have him shrug than the... I love the mustache. <laughs> Sheesh. Hello. I'm not going to yell at you. This chick is coming. Why are you not? Wait, what? <laughs> Hold on, you said what? If we film you, you're going to get a... There's nothing they can do about it, honey. It's a waste of police resources. I wouldn't. You're going all over the internet. We're going to get arrested for filming her? Karen, don't call the police! Absolutely! Oh, they live right there? She's starting shit with that dude who can't... I'm making sure you're not causing havoc. Come on, guys. Just go do your game over there, bro. Um, we were over here. She actually came over here. I know because we don't need this over here, guys. Yeah. Okay, what? Like, we don't need to be on the internet. We don't need none of this. Okay, then why would she come over here telling us she's going to call the cops on us? Yeah, if you don't want to be on camera, why are you walking up the camera? Well, because we're just making sure you know okay. everything's safe. No, no. What you did is perfect. Okay. You behaved, well, let me, let you behaved like a gentleman. Okay. What she speak. did let is let absolutely speak. uncalled for. Let 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 I'm just coming out here making sure you guys ain't causing havoc. Okay. Okay. And that's, you did that. And that's what I'm doing. And no one needs to be on the internet or filmed or... This all goes shoot. on the internet. I mean, if you guys want to, then that's your deal, but... Yeah. But she came over here for not, no reason at all. I would recommend not to put us on the internet. We, we have every right to take pictures. That's right. I know. I get, it. Don't listen to me. All right. I get it. I do love your artwork, no, though. I get it, yeah. That's cool. But... I let you speak, and when it's time, we're gonna speak. You don't. Well, know I know what you guys are doing, bro. It's a stupid shit. You guys okay, so hold on, hold on. Followers. Well, no, no. Let me, let me, let me answer that though. You, know, you say you're, you're doing? you say you know what we're doing, right? Well, it seems like you're just trying to grab followers, like. All okay, that's not, that's not at all. Okay. So we're First Amendment. What are you doing? We're First Amendment activists. Okay. Okay. We film in public places and see how okay. people respond to us exercising our rights in public. Right. So and then, just, and then we audit the situations that warrant police responses to us. Okay. And we see how they're going to respond and whatnot. And it just so happens that I don't know who this woman is That's to you, but idea. okay. So she came down here out of, for no reason at all, yelled at us, told us we can't film. It's illegal. And she's calling the police on us and we're going to jail for filming her. 
So that is a spectacle go. she created. It's not illegal. I'm gonna film her. I'm gonna film anyone who comes up to my camera. No, I mean, you film this guy over here. No, I think it's I'm stupid filming everybody. what you're doing because you're just causing. No, you, you think it's illegal. Well, no, you're just no, no. causing an Hold on. The First Amendment, though. Okay, that's great. Your First Amendment has that. to be exercised or we lose it. No, you, what you're doing is you're, you're trying to make an excuse to cause. Okay, they're not gonna do anything. Listen, to cause trouble. Because if you guys were really like badasses, you would take the covers off your mask. No, because we actually we'll educate know, people to create their saying. own privacy. Yeah, it has nothing to do with that. That's what I'm saying. Like, if you guys were really like not trying to trying to expose yourselves and trying to, I get it. It's your first amendment. Blah 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 blah. But look at okay. It. But your attitude towards the first amendment tells more about you than me. No, I it don't does. go around filming people causing okay, issues. Can I make a statement without being you interrupted? Sure can, bro. Okay. You sure can, brother. I'm going to call you that. Sure. Okay. You are covered in head, from head to toe in tattoos. That's right. And I love that. Great. There's a lot of people that judge you for it. There's a lot of people, and you know this, you get it's the looks. Whatever, bro, okay. But that's on me. Okay, exactly. I don't go around okay. filming people. I don't though. either. I, like, no, no, but listen, no, no, hold like on. No, no, hold here. on. We didn't get anyone's face. We exist on the sidewalk. But what he I, actually okay, came out so, and got in our face. Right. Because here's the thing. If you guys were normal human beings, just like we didn't get in your right, wife's face, listen, she listen, came over okay, to our face. Okay, that's fine. Listen. We're allowed to do it. Huh? We're allowed do to do it. I know. They're that's, not gonna do anything. Okay. They're just trying to get those followers. They're gonna educate you. They're not gonna do okay. anything. Karen. Okay, hey, hey, keep it down. Okay. What do you mean? Just, you don't get to tell us to keep it down. She's okay, screaming okay, at us. Okay, he's literally right. yelling at us. Just, like, oh, if wait. you control your chick a little more, you okay. don't have to worry about controlling you know us what, because it's not going to happen. I'm going to let it go because... You should. Here's the thing. You should let it go. I We're will. just I filming know. in public. We came I here for the library. The to, the police we came here for the library. We didn't if, come here if, for you guys. If you knew what we were up to and... Guys like you put masks on. Bro. Guys, and guys like... You can't okay. So if you think right. we're out here for reactions, why would you come up right. and give us a reaction if that's what you think we're here for? Because I'm going to walk away because I know that's what you're after and it's not going to happen with me. You already did. She did too. It just happened, my bro. Thanks for it. But you guys have a better day. Be blessed. What is that supposed to mean? The cops aren't going to do anything. That, you're disturbing the peace, sir. The police right. aren't going to do anything. You're disturbing the peace. That's a crime. In fact, they actually talked to us up the street. They're not going to do anything. They already spoke to us. We're literally just going to film the police doing nothing. Yes, we're going to film them again doing nothing. You're going on the internet. We're good, and thank you. Take you. That however you want. We're good, thank you. Because <laughs> that's what real men, real men do, bro. No, real, real men just walk away. No, well, camera man never dies. Real men just walk away. These guys are filming people. I know they're being menaces. We're being menaces? You're being a menace. You're tapping into your fear. You guys. You're tapping into your fear. It's just the camera. It's just the camera. It's just the camera. You guys hide behind. It's called privacy. Camera, you hide behind. It's bro. called privacy. Oh, now I'm in front of it. You know what privacy is? Bye. Hey, beautiful man. <laughs> How you doing? That's a emotionally stable reaction to being filmed in public, and I love it. <laughs> you have? A, are we blocking your car, sir? Sorry about that. No worries. No worries. You have a blessed day, my friend. You too. Yeah. Why does everybody out here go to the same hairstylist, though? Guys, yeah, we're going to come in here to the library. we got to use our library voice. Everybody keep it down. I get it done. They done. Which one, which one is the librarian? Nadia, but she's in the back. Oh, no, I just, I, I thought it was going to be one of you two, but that's fine. I already met her outside. She's really nice. So. Sure. Yep. How you guys doing? We're just going to do a walk around the damn smaller yeah. library. Oh, yeah, but the last one yeah. is huge compared to this. It's really small. But that's cool, though. <laughs> big, there's a lot of big problems to it now. <laughs> so we got a little kiosk. 
Can you check out books at the kiosks? Oh, that's cool. <laughs> oh shit, the gathering and gang of people in there. They're multiplying. Yeah, they're looking for us. He's going to go, oh, where they went. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, they're looking for us. It's funny. Yeah, he is looking for us. I agree, though. Uh, this fool said, is that Morgan Freeman? Children's area. Unfortunately, I'll have to ask you to go to our adults. No, no. So we're not. We're not. So we're not here to film children or anything like that. We're oh, that's just, okay. It's just yeah. Our, it's, yeah. The only reason we're in here was because it was empty. Oh yeah, yeah, absolutely. And that's what I was gonna say. Our library policy: if you're not with the child, um, oh, yeah. that we ask that you. Of course. We can vacate oh, yeah. the so, children's area, yes. and it was fine. But now that I do have okay, a child, no worries. Yeah, no worries. Sorry about so, that. No, no. <laughs> we'll, 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 we, we don't have to respect that request, but we will because you, you are so <laughs> kind about it. I appreciate that. Thank you. Yep. I actually like this library. It's very. Windowy. <laughs> it's new. Yeah. What's that? It's pretty new. Is it? When was it built? Uh, 2019. It's got. Oh, it's really nice. We've gone to a lot of libraries that are just walls and then windows in the front, and it's kind of dark in there. Oh yeah. So this is cool. Oh. Are you guys taking a seat now? Are you guys? <laughs> What's that? A card. A card? We do not have a card. You want what? I can't hear you. We don't share it while we're working. Yeah. Appreciate you asking though. <laughs> What's that? Where? Uh, Patreon, things like that. Yep. You have a good day, buddy. Where's my Modelo? Bro, with a little tahine. Come on, brother. That lime. Lisa Corona. <laughs> hey, be blessed, man. That was the oh, fakest turnaround. Oh, can I get a card? Can I see the... work vehicles right now that just stopped right here. What's that? Come on. I understand that. <laughs> I don't know. Something about you wants to home again. <laughs> Hey, if he wants to fuck my mom, that's okay. That's a, she's ugly. Yeah, my mother is real oh. nasty, man. Do yes, you can. Yeah. And apparently he's doing it too. He's got like one of those weird. We don't. It's all the way in the sky, bro. Is it? It's in the sky. Yeah, I think I lined it wrong. No, they're just practicing their public rights. We're practicing our First Amendment rights. When you're in this country, we have freedom of speech. How does the microphone work? The microphone works fantastic. Which we're allowed to do. Oh, yeah. Hey. Oh, okay. You guys have a really creepy vibe. What's oh, going on? So, if you really thought that we were creepy, why are you gonna walk right up to us? 
and because call us names. Here. Call you names? Yeah. You just called us creepy. Yes, I said you have a creepy vibe. Okay. Because I was working and you guys like wanted a picture of me and like went okay. in there. It was very odd to me. So I thought... I didn't go in anywhere. Oh, okay, okay. Your angle came in to my store, so I'm just curious okay. what's going on. You're defensive. I'm not. I'm just trying to figure out why. Because you came up and accosted me and called me a creep, so. You know what? Are you guys are very passionate. Which is all the same. Very passionate. You gave me a weirdo vibe. Well, yeah, okay. You're a weirdo, right? Yeah. Okay. Because, but you walked really far from your serious? business to come and accost us. It's very powered, like You're like, all oh, covered up. Oh, see, all you've done is call names. We've never called you a name. No, but you came into my work. Okay, and now you're getting in my face. Stop getting in my face. I didn't go into your work. You're right. You did not literally enter the door. But you guys... I can take a picture of you if I want. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Instead, you guys are going to look like idiots. I can film anything. I can. I can. It's legal for us to do that. You guys, you walked two blocks to come and accost us. Yes, because you both are talking at us at the same time. I absolutely do. You both are talking at us at the same time. You came a really long way to Why would you come up and accost us? That's a very bad look for a USPS store. Did you figure out your camera? Yeah. I actually have one of those. They're kind of a pain in the butt sometimes when you need to record in an emergency. <laughs> yeah. Did you figure it out though? Yeah, it's pretty sweet. There's a roller that kind of goes, okay. Yeah. yeah. I have one of those. Actually, it's a kind of badass. Yeah, I like it. Uh, because if I have two phones, mm -hmm. you know, I have two phones for filming. One, you know, I'll use it in my dash cam or I'll set up tripods. Nice. You know? This is nice just to have. Do you it. film also? Like, I'm assuming you film for mortgage, like for your the houses that real you show? Yeah, Perfect. Real um, you know what I got that is my favorite toy? Mm. The new Ray Bans. Yeah. I've thought about that. Oh, dude, um, they are sick. Yeah? Really? Yeah, because you got stuff, all you do is go, Ch and all of a sudden you're rolling and you're like at the gas station checking out some girl's ass. <laughs> <laughs> So, you saw the chaos that unfolded, obviously. Yeah. One of them came from almost a block and a half away to come and accost us over here about why we filmed our business. We didn't bother them. I'm cold, cordial with everybody, just like I've been cordial with you. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, this is how I respond. That mess is definitely uncalled for, but it's not something we instigated. We just film the businesses and we move on. Like, we're not bothering anybody. Yeah. That was chaos. So, you got quite yeah. a setup there. I do. It's beautiful. Is that a hard drive? Uh, actually, this is a charger to keep this charged. So I have two terabytes of storage on this one. Two terabytes? Yeah. How did you get that? iPhone, and then it automatically uploads to another two ter terabyte okay, uh, cloud. Okay, I have one terabyte. Yeah. You got a GoPro. Yep. Yeah. Oh, and then I have my lighting, and then I have a color light to adjust the color on people's faces to make it look like they're in their business. Yeah, that's cool. And then I have a color light to adjust the color on people's faces to make it So we're actually the fastest growing platform right now. What is it? I don't share it while we're working. Okay. How do I find out about it? So if you search up, I mean, I, I'm assuming you know we do First Amendment auditing. I don't know what you guys do. Okay, so that's what we do, First Amendment auditing. If you go on YouTube, you search it up, you'll find us at some point. Okay. So it's just called First Amendment auditing. Okay. So we exercise our First Amendment rights in public, uh, disseminate how people respond to us, exercise in our rights it could be the people that blow up on us like that it could be the cops that respond some of them act professionally some of them don't and it could be as simple as this engagement like you've done really well out here the big chocolate easter bunny i used to love these as a kid but the small edible version you have a good day brother you too, you too. You stay safe. absolutely oh yeah. You know, people. oh yeah i love your truck
This is the Karen Escapades right here. This is great. You guys are allowed to do that. I've kind of felt a little special for just a minute. That was a lot of cam backs at once. Very overwhelming. I know I'm beautiful, but it took a while to accept what was going on. I identify as a bicycle right now. I'm in the bike lane. Thank you for watching Impact Media, your go-to educational channel for all things public filming. We hope you found our content informative and engaging. Remember, your support is crucial in spreading our message far and wide. So, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button and share it with your friends and family. By doing so, you'll help us reach more people and make a positive impact in the world.